What is up guys? It's your buddy Aaron. Welcome back to another G35. A little vlog today. Um, just gonna try to quickly see what's going on with the G35. If you guys didn't see the uh, last video where we installed the, uh, the LED headlights on the G35, we actually took it out at the end of that video and went uh, drifting around my, well, just doing donuts around my buddy uh, Jason's 350Z. He's got a real nice wide body 350Z. Uh, shout out to him, Instagram right here. Check him out, guys. Super sick 350Z, he's awesome. Hi, right, yo. Yo. We out here. We out here. Anthony. I can't see. There you are. Nice. Don't look at my Instagram name. I didn't do this illegal shit. It's a normal day with a Z. It really sucks. Life's not fun. Driving in fucking warehouses for excitement while we got the boy Aaron over here about to like do some dumb shit around my car. But I fully support this dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? That was loud. Hey Aaron. Hey. I'm vlogging for you. Alright, sweet. I heard you talking. <laughs> I know. You're not going to want any of this on your video. Alright, alright. So yeah, video. I'm not stopping you. You're you have to, you have to physically watch all of this just okay. to get to this point. I will edit all of it. I hope he does not put this on a video. I'm still. <laughs> Yo, oh my god, my heart's racing. <laughs> I did not want to hit it, yo. <laughs> Anyway, as a result of that, um, right after that, the car was running good. I went to go get some Pollo Tropical, and <laughs> while I was waiting for my food in the drive through like, the car just started misfiring out of nowhere, and my check engine light started flashing when I was trying to drive it home, and it was running on, like, two or three cylinders. Like, all you heard, it kind of sounded like a rotary, or like it was cammed or something, because all you hear is brum, 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 and yeah, it sounded like shit. It's still running like shit right now, so I want to go ahead and use, um, I got this little product um, from Linky Tech. Technology LTD they sent me out this little Bluetooth adapter. It's an OBD2 reader pretty much hook it up to your OBD port in the G Or in any car you have literally works with every single car as long as it has OBD2 You plug it into the port you hook up the Bluetooth to your to your cell phone You download the app that they have it's called the Autel AP 200 It helps you read codes live data a little bit more functions than the like the normal cheap Bluetooth adapters that you guys get off of Amazon and whatnot They're like seven dollars chipping a little bit extra money for a lot more of a quality product and they provide provide you their own app and everything that is free. It's really nice and easy to use. So we're gonna go ahead and see if we can get any type of diagnostic done on the G right now. Um, being that the check engine light was flashing, I don't know if there's any code stored in the system. Maybe this will pull it up, but I don't know because that's, it's kind of weird. Cause when you turn on the car, there's no check engine light. Only when you're driving it and the RPMs are at like a certain, uh, like three or four K. I don't know guys, we'll see. We'll see, let's do it. Right, guys pretty much find out where your obd2 port is in the g35 it's right here just to the left of the steering wheel once you plug it in it'll turn green then you got to go ahead and connect it to your phone and it'll turn blue it sounds like shit right now on the phone i'm just going to go ahead and select the eobd we're going to do a auto scan general Detecting, it's gonna grab information, we'll see what happens. Well, I got a check engine light now. Yeah, so the codes I'm getting right here is the uh, the random multiple misfire code. We're thinking it might have to be something to do with the coil packs actually, and maybe not the cam sen sensor, because it is starting right up. Oh. This is the homie Darrell. That's Yo, what it is, call 2010. Him D. You already know. First one's already? It's the first one. It's the first, so you're already unplugged and it's running the same. Wow, so that one's bad. So that's how you already know. Yo, everyone was asking me about these Chinese coils too. Like, how are, how long are they gonna last, bro? They suck. They suck. So I have some extras. I'm, 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 let's pop let's pop that one in real quick. So we just pulled this old Chinese one out. It, it looks like it's still good. It's not in bad shape. It's literally brand new, kind of like just like six months old. Looks can be deceived. Yeah, buddy. Let's see what's up. Nice. Let's see if it was just one. It said random multiple, so maybe the one caused it. Maybe not. Better, 
better. It's definitely running better, but there's another one. Oh yeah. There's definitely another one. Hold on, let me see. Oh, he's gonna pull him out. <laughs> Savage. That one too? Oh my God. All right. Oh, the front one again? Damn, it was boom, boom, right across from each other. I'm so happy I kept those OEM ones. Oh, yeah. Oh, I think that's a, yeah, that's an OG one. Oh, shit. Yeah, man. Is it? Yeah, it's it has been, the F on it. Yeah, he's been hanging out for he's a while. He's been hanging out for a while. And that's it. I'm plug her in and see what's up. Oh, shit. Oh my god, dude. Yo, that's awesome, bro. <laughs> Quit passing the house, Appreciate brother. you, John. That's what we do, man. Thanks. All right, guys, I just went ahead and hit the clear DTC, so it's going to connect with it right now. All right, so now it says no fault codes detected. Let's go ahead and give it a start and see what's good. Yeah, boy. Check it out. We got that GS. You already know one Jay Z. Oh, it's a two in there. Oh, it's a two in there. It's a two in there. Oh, it's a two in there. Okay, my bad. I don't know my GS is that well. I'm gonna get fried in the YouTube comments. And this baby right here. So, what's going in here? Right here, yo. Yeah, man. Right on. Take that 3.0 out of there. Put the good 3.5 in there. Yeah, bro. He just took this out today, so he's got it all, you know, all closed up right now. He. Pretty much did everything top end to it out of this one right here, the maximum 3.5. So with the axles and everything, bro, the axles are still on there. <laughs> Worked it all together, man. Yeah, so he's gonna put it on this thing. He's gonna make this thing a sleeper. Get this little junk box out of here. Yeah, so this one is gonna get out of here, and he's already got like a really clean engine bay in here. You can see most of it's already painted, but he says he's gonna be redoing it all, so. Definitely gonna be coming back at you guys with some good shit with this and the G. Yeah, so huge thanks to D. We're gonna go ahead and take out the uh, the G right now. Take it on the ride and see how good it, it, it rides and just make sure everything's cool. And that's about it. Much love to the neighbor. Slide and Friday, baby. Yo, that's how we do it. <laughs> All right, dude, take it easy, man. That man's always got my back. Yo, whenever I have car trouble, that boy. So now we have one more Lifesaver quote pack left. I'm definitely gonna be putting this in a little emergency lunch box, toolbox that I have that I keep in the G35 just in case, you know, anything happens, that little lunch box. Just keep everything here, a little extra tools just in case, you know, get on the, on the side of the road, you gotta fix something, you gotta zip tie something up, you gotta put a coil pack in, you know, got everything you need right here. Yo, Cookie, we fixed the G35. Yeah, yeah, we, we fixed it. Uh-huh, yep, you already know, we the best. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and huge shout outs to D for coming over and helping us out and just being a savage and pulling out those ignition coils to see which one was faulty. The first two that we pulled out were the only two that were bad, thank God. And I had those spares so just went ahead and popped those in and we were good. If you guys like this video and you guys want to see some more like just quick little vlogs like this with the G and some other stuff, um, just smash that like button, hit that subscribe, let me know down in the comments and I will catch you guys in the next video. Take it easy.